All right, welcome back. So in the last session, we got started with if looping, right? So this is one of the ways you could just use the if statement and iterate through your chart. This was really simple. Uh, this was just to show you how you could just get started with if statement. Um, let's let's try to get a little more deeper and let's try to use a little more complex scenario. Over the last session, we used a very simple if statement. If the value of env, I'll just open the values file also. So spit it right. Um, so if you look at the deployment, if the value of env is equals to false, create this one, otherwise don't, all right? So now what we want is, we want a statement wherein if the value of load balancer is node port or load balancer, if the value of the uh, type is node port or load balancer, create a parameter. Now that parameter could be external traffic policy. That value could be anything, all right? So what I want is if this value is this, create this otherwise not so let's try to see how let's let's see how we could just achieve it all right so i'm going to use the if statement over here if so first thing would be dot i can't use the value again because value dot service is already used so and type is already there right so type is already there all right so dot type if dot type is equals to load balancer load balancer or or if the value dot value okay dot type is node port so if you notice, we are not using one statement, we are using two. If this and this, how do you use the and or or statement? First of all, enclose this into a bracket. All right, first statement, enclose into a bracket. Second statement, enclose into a bracket. Looks good. Now put an equals to sign also, whatever statement you want to use, okay? Put it over here also. This is basic as we did in the deployment also, right? Nothing fancy over here. Cool, once that is done, how do you use or statement or and statement? You use it over here or and or anything, right? So I'm gonna use or, put in a bracket over here, end the bracket right over here. All right, so what I'm doing is, um, and I'm enclosing the or bracket over here also. And gonna end it over here. Cool. So what we're doing is if dot type, value of dot type is load balancer or node put, one of them, right? Then create this guy over here, external traffic policy, which is equals to again dot type and I can probably put it under use this one and put it over here dot type dot okay not dot type dot external All right yeah I am gonna just end it and see how it behaves All right so now if you look at the helm chart services in the service we haven't got any parameter named as external traffic policy since the value of our service type is node port which 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 satisfy this if condition we should have an external traffic policy now underneath over here so let's build it all right so let's try to build it and see if there are any typos or anything okay Let's see what does it say. It says load balancer can't give you equal function. So let's try to see. So it looks like, can you guess the error by the way? 
it I have already guessed uh, uh, identified the error if you look at over here there is an extra brace over here I'm just gonna remove it and dry run all right since, since we are not copying pasting we're writing things from scratch errors are ought to happen if you're in rush I would expect you or recommend you to watch the videos in 1.5x speed and you should be fine all right so our charts are rendered now if you go to the top and look at the service you have the parameter now available external traffic policy as cluster which was missing before right which was not here so now if I change this if the type is something else and now if I try to do it it'll it'll just it doesn't satisfy the if statement right because value of type is neither load balancer nor cluster and it is not going to create this external traffic policy now if i try to run dry run you would see that there are no external policy appearing over here yep there are no external policy so yeah this is you this is how you could just use multiple conditions use the statements like or or and and then probably manipulate it over uh, pure manifest also this is a very classic example uh, it doesn't matter whichever environment you want to if you want to learn you could just go ahead and implement that in your existing project as well see understand helm is pretty easy to get started you could just uh, be content with only using simpler stuff however if you want to upskill yourself try utilizing these statements and add a little value to whatever you are doing all right i hope this was informative thank you